All right, let's take a look here at Google Classroom Scenario 3. Uh, in this scenario, we're taking a look at using the join link uh, to help get students uh, into your classroom a lot easier. So very traditionally, uh, what a lot of teachers will do will simply do uh, click on this button here and then start typing in students' names um, and it automatically email them the link. <coughs> uh, another method, uh, and th this is probably the fastest method, so if I'm just going to type a student's name in here that I want them to add, it's going to send them a link that they simply click on. Another way to do this um, is to, uh, and when they click, and you click here, you can copy this link and you can send a manual email or a or a direct chat message uh, to a uh, to a student pasting that link in there. The most common way that teachers will usually get uh, students into the Google Classroom is when they come to their uh, uh, to the settings here and they will then usually display the class code like this. A lot of teachers will have these written up on the uh, on the whiteboard for most of the year so kids uh, as they come and leave the classroom they can do the code. But the uh, uh, very probably easiest way uh, is a, a fast way to get kids in. All they have to do is click the link is to use the join link where they can either copy and paste this link into an email or they can automatically email them uh, from uh, from here.